Les sauvés ont votre train là Les gens sont les fins noirs Pour nous faire nous gagner ça Au compte ça qui passe Do you know what's up now The Asian Americans be up now Why you all riding in a rig now Au compte ça qui passe I'm your host, Lavelle Martini, and I have here the very, very recognizable face, Success Junior. Some hey. fella, man. Some fella. What are you doing in Atlanta? Bumzu. Bumzu Sakbase. Right there. I just moved there, and I didn't know this many Haitians lived here. You live in Atlanta? Yes, I do live in Atlanta now. I do live in Atlanta. Oh, you know, when did that happen? Uh, July. I'm Bob Cache. No, 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 no. I'm Bob Cache. No, man. Miss Akrivé. The middle of me moving was the start of my tour. So I was never really here, but I was here. So it was like, I'm in and out. But I'm here for a good three weeks before I leave again. Okay, so how you liking it here versus Florida? I don't like it. You see, I'm wait, wearing wait, jacket. wait, I'm wearing wait, the jacket. Stop. It's too cold. It's too cold. They say get cold, man, but this is too cold. It's what not even mean? really cold yet. What do you mean yet? Yet. What do you mean yet? Don't go for it. That's no problem. I'm going back to Florida. Well, welcome to Atlanta. And Hotlanta is supposed to be Hotlanta. And um, success, you've had a lot of success with your character and, you know, the mother. And uh, is that really a character of your mom? Or how did you come up with her, with, with the character of your mother? Uh, it's a character of my mom, my aunt, my grandma. So, to me, my aunt, my grandma, it was in. Anybody that played a mother character in my life, uh, I put them all in one. So it's like my mother's too, but they, they're all my mother. That's why she doesn't have a name. That's why she's just Junior's mom. So Junior, so all these skits that you do, are they actual? They're very relatable. We can all relate to them. So these are actual situations that have happened, you know, in the church. She's praying for you. She's telling all your business. <laughs> Right, just as one example, are these actual situations? Sad, sadly, it is true. Um, tout bas de vérité, moi je me fais pas fou. Um, if I do, you'll notice it's extra, but everything I do is is there's some truth to it, and I, I like to just represent the Haitian mother, who's a backbone to um, the Haitian community. Period. Haitian families. It's the black mother or the Haitian mother, you know, for us. So. That, that's that's my goal. So when I'm sitting next, mama. So I be ma. The wig, the whole bit. Is that all the aunties, mom, grandma, and all that, or you came up with that separately? Uh, that was by mistake because I didn't want to wear a dress. So I put what I don't. I still don't even know what what it, I don't know if it's a towel or blanket. What is it? What is it? I don't know what it is. Um, the wig I got a long time ago. And obviously the glasses I got from like Dollar Tree. And then it's those three things, makeup. If I put those three things on, total change. So that's it. I mean, it, it, the, the, the image, I came up with it. But the content, those are real life experiences. It seems like every Haitian mother is the same or do the same things. And so you've been able to really make this materialize into a career. We went from, you know, a skit being funny on social media to now a career. So what have you been able to do with this character? Um, I've, I've been able, I'm working on a sitcom. So my own, my own, Gosh, really? my own, t yeah, my own TV sitcom. Um, I got my own products coming out, my own cremas, my own chips, my own everything. So 2019 is going to be beautiful. Um, all from a character that I had, it's like, I wish I knew, you understand? But I didn't, you know, God has his timing for everything. Because maybe if I had all this money back then, I wouldn't have a money at all. I wouldn't have money at all. I would have blew it, but. So can you tell us a bit more about the sitcom? Uh, the sitcom is basically like my skits, but longer. Kind of like a George Lopez, but for the Haitian version. So I'm putting us on a map, the clean way. I'm trying. Okay, so will this be on a cable network, one of the uh, local networks? Where will this be aired and when? Right now, we're in the filming uh, process. Uh, we don't know exactly who's going to pick it up. I'm, not, I'm going to be honest with you guys. 
You have to shop it. Yeah, well, kind of, because we have some offers on the table. So, success, Junior. Yes. Si vous avez bon menti, on ti, qu'a senti mon so bon moi, of the character. You know what? My voice is hoarse. Pas attendez. I can't, I can't do it. My voice is like gone. So, I wish I could. I wish okay. I could. But he's in Atlanta, which means I should be able to have a little bit more access to success, hopefully. But congratulations. I'm glad uh, to see this go so far from you for for you. And the fact that a sitcom is coming that represents Haitian culture, Haitian people is awesome. So congratulations about that. Um, and like you said, he has food line coming up. Look out for that. Bon bal bon manger, mes amis. Cremas, potato chips, qui sont encore dit? Cremas, potato chips, um, a whole bunch of other things. I, I, I don't remember. I, but right now I know Cremas and the chips are the two things for sure that's coming out 2019. I can't wait to put us on the map and, you know, represent us well. Uh, show us that we're not, you know, dummies or pieces of crap like our president thinks. <laughs> Before we end uh, the interview, what would you like to share with those out there that aspire to do what you're doing? To be a comedian, to do stand-up, to host, and, and so on. What would you share with them as a tip or, or inspiration for them to continue? Be original. If you copy somebody, I'm not just saying me or anyone else that who you like, it's not going to get you far because someone else is already doing it. What got me to my position is that I'm original. Um, yeah, there are some people who's mocked their mothers before me, but I came in with my own style. I don't copy anybody. Everything is from here. I try my hardest, but um, stay original. Cre be creative. That's how you're gonna go far. If you're copying someone, you're gonna get you're gonna get a little buzz, but it's gonna eventually die down because it's not yours. So that's all. Originality is the key. Originality. That's it. So thank you, success, no for the interview. And again, I'm proud of you. Continue doing what you're doing. Can I say one more thing? Of course. Of course. Oh, because I'm about to Creole. Listen, listen. I'm going to speak English. We're in America. I'm going to try to speak English. I want you guys to speak English with me. Let me my pale Creole, let my ET. Right now, I'm in Atlanta, okay? I'm in Itazini, okay? Who are you talking about Kringlish? Yes, Kringlish. I'm going to speak Kringlish. But yeah, I got you. But who are you talking about? You're talking about English anyway. You don't even talk Creole that much anymore. It's English, it's music, it's English, right? Whenever I go to Haiti, they speak English with me. Or French, and I was just like, uh, uh, <laughs> like I know. All right, so thank you so much again. La Belle Martini for Ukon Sac Passe. See you next time.